Hello folks and welcome to Cisco Baltic Edition and welcome to Seimas, the parliament in Lithuania here in Vilnius. Um, I'm here with Mr. Arna Suikis. He's the managing director for communications at Lithuanian Radio and Television. Arnas, we're standing here in front of something spectacular. Oh, yeah. The red carpet stand. Yeah, so half a year ago it was we just uh, as the YouTube uh, subscriber of Bal uh, Cisco Baltic Edition would uh, remember, we, we talked about the vision and uh, the idea to help uh, media, uh, to help the broadcasters uh, to make it easier interviews, to have the live transmissions from several places, uh, yeah, lower cost, fast, quick, best quality. As you remember, we talked about just about the idea. And now... It's a reality. It's reality. And it looks fantastic. Thank you very much. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you very much. We are also very proud to, uh, to have uh, LRT as the public broadcasters of Lithuania. So we are really proud to be such a modern broadcaster. And, uh, and, and, and Seimas is, I would say, it's also... Uh, Seimas also become, uh, becomes much, much more modern to, to have this implementation, this stand, this uh, red carpet project. It, it, it is an amazing piece of technology, but why are you doing this? What is the reason behind? Surely, I mean, there, there are some some reasons. There are many reasons, actually. Uh, yeah, to be uh, as quick as possible to get the fastest interview from Seimas. So we do not need to send a cameraman. We do not need to send a lighting guy, uh, sound man, and and other uh, journalists. So we just. Uh, with the help of uh, Cisco equipment, equipment, we can do interviews anytime is needed. We just call a parliamentarian and they will come on the red carpet and uh, <laughs> and that's it. And it's an interview. And yeah, it's easier for everybody and it's really modern. <laughs> so I, I, I like the design. Um, you have all the, the bits and pieces integrated. The stand looks fantastic and there's only one button. Yeah, and that's the mute button. Mute button, <laughs> so you can mute. But even even that, it will be uh, remotely controlled. So uh, every uh, we could, uh, if the parliamentarian wouldn't, uh, uh, yeah, press the uh, mute button, so we can uh, press uh, for themselves. Now, guys, let's see what the parliament itself thinks about this solution and how it can change the work parliamentarians do. With me, I have uh, Loretta Raulinaitita. You are the director of all communications at the national parliament in Lithuania. Now, it is a cool piece of technology, uh, but there's more to that. Um, where do you see this benefit for the parliament itself? No doubt, it is something that is very, very innovative. And uh, yesterday, when the board of the parliament unanimously approved this project, we were very uh, excited about that because it's really important for the parliament, for the SEMAS of the Republic of Lithuania, to remain open and transparent. In fact, the parliament is the most uh, transparent institution, state institution in Lithuania. And this new project will uh, allow national parliamentarians uh, to discuss, debate, voice their opinions on anything that is happening in the parliament. I just wish we had it during our presidency. And this um, new project, the red carpet project, will allow national par par parliamentarians to directly and in real time to say what they think about specific pieces of legislation so that Lithuanian public knows their opinion. What is the value for the Lithuanian people of, of being able to, to have access to you know, uh, parliamentarians on, on such a short notice? It is uh, something that uh, we will, I'm sure, uh, we will have, uh, we will see the real value in, uh, in time. It's, it's difficult to say uh, exactly, specifically to, uh, now, but, but I have no doubt that this will imme immediately start um, improving access to uh, specific legislators. Where do you see innovation happening in the SEMAS? I just uh, see Seimas as, um, as the innovator, as a pioneer for other institutions to follow. And I think that the president's office and the, uh, the government office, different ministries, of course, uh, would like to follow the suit and uh, would like to have a, a project like this uh, because it, it open up so, opens up so many opportunities. Uh, and, and I said one of the biggest advantage that is done in real time, because um, especially in legislation, the process is so vivid and changes come 
every minute. So, you know, in the morning you may have uh, one piece of legislation looking one way and in the afternoon you may have major changes introduced here in this plenary room or in a committee room um, and, and having very, very important impact for the public. So I think this, this is, a, is a wonderful opportunity for all parliamentarians working in the plenary, working in the committees, in the specialized commissions, all of them, political groups, will, I'm sure, use this tool um, on a daily basis.